Hi, and welcome to another Harry's Hobbies video. And yes, I'm still doing the uh, Wild West diorama. And I'm still working on Doc Holliday's Apothecary. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how I go about doing the windows. And uh, it's not by using the uh, little pieces of plastic that come with the kit. As you can see, I've got those in my hand right here. These are the little pieces of plastic. I don't use those because I'm going for a little different effect. And uh, they do give you a pretty good starting point, but uh, for all practical purposes, I prefer to do my own little thing. And that consists of getting our uh, windows out ready. And what I've already done is, is I've, I have already painted the uh, basic outline colors that I'll be using for the window frames themselves, which is a light blue. And then for the outer frames is a dark blue. And uh, to do this, it's really rather simple. I take just a little bit of Elmer's glue and place some on the little workspace here. And then I take a toothpick And uh, I pick up some of the glue and then I proceed to swirl it until it fills in the space. On the uh, on the piece. And sometimes this is pretty quick. And occasionally, uh, even after it's dried you'll find that you'll need to uh, go back and redo one or two windows. But that's a that's a rare thing that happens. And then I just simply do this until I have all the windows on a particular piece covered in. And the other reason I go ahead and paint is the paint provides a pretty good place for the uh, Elmer's glue to grab onto. Now there are some products out there that, that can do this themselves. One of them is called, I think it's Crystal Clear. But uh, I found that pretty much it's... Uh, Similar to it, I know it's not Elmer's glue, but it's similar, and the viscosity is about the same. And uh, I just find that using Elmer's glue is a phenomenally cheaper and provides a, a reasonable result when it's dry. And then I set this off to the side to dry. And try to keep it raised so that the glue doesn't actually like bond with the paper or anything like that. And then I move on to the to the next one. And this one has got more windows on it. So what I'll do from here, I'm going to speed the video up from here. So that you don't get too bored seeing the same thing over and over. So, and here we go with that. And there we have the initial uh, work done for the windows. Now it's just a matter of allowing those to dry. And uh, I'm going to try to do something a little different and follow it up with this. Uh, and that's going to be, I'm going to try to shoot a time lapse of this drying up. So we'll see how that works out. If not, well, 
you're not going to see it. So <laughs> don't uh, don't worry if it's if it's uh, missing from the video. So again, thanks for watching this part. I appreciate it.